Hello, my name is Emma Paulino and I am a community pharmacist from Portugal, president of the National Pharmacy Association and a board member of the International Primary Care Respiratory Group. Community pharmacies are a gateway to care and as such assume their responsibility in implementing interventions that are people-centered whilst making better use of healthcare resources available. One of the most cost-effective interventions in healthcare is vaccination. And we know that vaccination is particularly important in more vulnerable populations at risk for complications, as is the case for people with chronic respiratory conditions. International recommendations for immunization in people with chronic respiratory conditions include the flu vaccine every year to protect against seasonal flu, pneumococcal vaccines to protect against serious pneumococcal diseases, also the COVID-19 vaccine with a frequency yet to be determined, the Tdap vaccine to protect against tetanus, diphtheria and pertussis or whooping cough when the person was not vaccinated in adolescence, and also the zoster vaccine to protect against shingles when the person is 50 years or older. Vaccines can positively impact health, cognitive development and productivity. We have healthier lives, less severe forms of disease, fewer limitations in terms of family and social interactions, and a better functional ability. Another aspect to have in mind is that vaccines have a broad impact on health extending beyond the vaccinated individual. And, as mentioned before, vaccines are not only cost-effective but also cost-saving. Pharmacists can improve the vaccination rate among people with COPD and asthma by recognizing the factors that influence the decision by acting as counselors. And they can also promote the administration of vaccines in the pharmacy itself as a service. Opportunities for improvement include additional training of the pharmacist and other pharmacy staff, raising awareness of the pharmacist's contribution, ensuring remuneration systems are in place for pharmaceutical interventions, integrating health information technologies for seamless transfer of information and promote increased physician-pharmacist collaboration. Thank you very much for your attention.